Hello, my name is Jacob, and let's walk through stats.gallery, which is a web application that I've been working on the past couple of months. When you first visit stats.gallery, you'll be greeted by this landing page. If you scroll down, you can see some of the features that Stats Gallery has to offer. All right, so here I can type in the name of my near account and then press show stats. Here the dashboard loads and we have a bunch of little cards here that are showing different statistics about my near account. Let's look at the first one, the score widget. Stats Gallery has a scoring algorithm that is calculated based on your account's activity on mainnet. So here you can see my account score is 914. Right now there's only one recent point earning record listed and we can change that by changing the activity that we want to see from the past week to all of the activity. And now we'll load in a lot more data. The scoring algorithm calculates the score based on different types of transactions and you can see the score values here. Here are all of the different times that my account has received scores. And that's it for the score widget. Next we have the level widget, which calculates a level ranking based on your score. So here I am level four, which is apprentice, and the named levels go up to level 10 which is near cat. Now let's move on to the activity rank widget, which will show you your account's activity ranking against other accounts on the network. So right now my account is about 9,500th ranked against other accounts, which is about the 99th percentile. The balance widget here shows my current unlocked balance of near tokens here, as well as some of the recent transfers to different near accounts. And I can view more of the transfers here. This widget, the brief stats widget, shows a few interesting statistics about my account. For example, the number and direction of transactions that I have sent, the amount of gas I have burned on transactions, and the age of my account here, which is 220 days. The weekly transaction rate widget shows how many transactions I've conducted in the past week, which is two. And then this transaction history widget visualizes the transactions that an account has performed along with uh, the interactions with the top three most interacted with accounts. So this is a nice way to visualize your activity with different accounts that you regularly interact with. Now let's move on to the stats page here. And here we can see first the balance history chart, which shows the balance of the unlocked balance of an account across time since the account was created. The action types chart here shows the proportion that different transactions that you have sent from your account are, uh, whether they're transfers, token transfers, function calls, uh, different key manipulation events, contract deployments, etc. Here are the top 10 senders of transactions to my account and the top 10 receivers of transactions from my account. Now let's move on to the transactions page. And here we can see I have sent 130 transactions, 37 are incoming transactions and 93 are outgoing or my, my account is 130 transactions uh, related to it, either sent from or sent to. We can filter the different transactions by incoming, outgoing, or function call. And each of these overviews here, if you click on the transaction hash, it will direct you to the Explorer page for that transaction. You can see a little bit of 
additional metadata, such as the function call name here, or the public key for an add key here, or the value of a token transfer, as well as the date of that transaction. Now let's take a look at the quests page. And this is one of the very uh, unique and special features of Stats Gallery. So you can see here, um, up on the top, I have these three different badges assigned. Let me just reload the page here. And these green check marks here correspond to different badges I have earned. So, for example, this one of the one of a kind quest I have completed by receiving an NFT. Therefore, I've been awarded the one of a kind badge, which is designated as rare because only 1.8% of users have unlocked this badge. We are working on adding more badges, so keep your eyes peeled for more interesting quests for you to complete on the near network. Now, if we hop over to the leaderboards page, we can see the list of the richest accounts on Near. first of which is Binance1.Nier, and the top scoring accounts ranked by the Stats Gallery scoring algorithm. If we click on one of the accounts here, such as Binance1.Nier, the top balance account here with about 43 million Near tokens, it will bring us to the overview page for this account where we can also see its score, its level, its balance, etc. as well as different interactions that this account regularly performs. If you have any questions, comments, or feedback about this application, please use these buttons here. The feedback will direct you to a Google form and the reports button will direct you to the GitHub issues page. The last page I want to overview in this video is the story page where you can read about the history of this project and a little bit about the team, myself and Dan, who have worked to build this application. And you can also see a little bit of our project roadmap here, which contains plans we have for the future of this project. The final thing before I let you go is I would highly recommend you check out the dark theme of this web application, which you can access by changing your operating system theme preference to dark. All right, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please check out stats.gallery and use it to explore your near account and any other accounts you may be interested in. Goodbye.